Hi everyone, I'm Kaylee from the Early Years Alliance and welcome to today's story sack session. Now are we ready? As we do with all of our story sack sessions, we always have to start with a hello song. So have you all got some big and wavy hands for me today? Are we ready? Hello, all the boys. Hello, all the girls. Hello, everyone. It's nice to see you here. That was brilliant. You think we could do it again? Are we ready? Hello, all the boys. Hello, all the girls. Hello, everyone. It's nice to see you here. Well done, everybody. It's lovely to see you today. And today's story is one of my favourites because we've got The Snail and the Whale by Julia Donaldson. And we'd like to thank Macmillan Publishing House for letting us use their story. Are we ready? The Snail and the Whale. Oh, let's have a look. Oh, oh got stuck at the pages. Look. There we go. There we are. Look, this is the tale of a tiny snail and a great big grey blue humpback whale. This is the rock. You see the rock. This is the rock as black as soot. And this is the snail with the itchy foot. The sea snail slithered all over the rock and gazed at the sea and the ships in the dock. And as she gazed, she sniffed inside. The sea is deep and the world is wide. How I long to sail, said the tiny snail. <gasps> and she's looking out over the sea. These are the other snails in the flock who all stuck tight to the smooth black rock and said to the snail with the itchy foot, be quiet, don't wriggle, sit still, stay put. But the tiny sea snail sighed and sniffed, then cried, I've got it, I'll hit your lift. This is the trail of the tiny snail, a silvery trail that looped and curled and said, lift wanted around the world. A lift wanted look and she's used her tail and a snail, the slime to make a message. This is the whale. Look at that big whale. Does it fit on my screen? This is the whale who came one night when the tide was high and the stars were bright. A humpback whale, immensely long, who sang to the snail a wonderful song of shimmering ice and coral caves and shooting stars and enormous waves. And this is the tail of the humpback whale. He held it out of the starlit sea and said to the snail, come with me. Where are they going to go? This is the sea, so wild and free, that carried the whale and the snail on his tail to towering icebergs and far off lands with fiery mountains and golden sands. Oh, there's the beach. These are the waves that arched and crashed, that foamed and frolicked and sprayed and splashed the tiny snail on the tail of the whale. Can you see him? These are the caves beneath the waves where stripy fish with feathery fins and sharks with hideous toothy grins 
swam round the whale and the snail on his tail there's the sharks oh no this is the sky so vast and high sometimes sunny blue and warm sometimes filled with a thunderstorm with zigzag lightning flashing and frightening the tiny snail on the tail of the whale oh no isn't it scared and she gazed at the sky the sea the land the waves the caves and the golden sand she gazed and she gazed amazed by it all and she said to the whale i feel so small <gasps> tiny on his tail but then came the day the whale lost his way these are the speedboats running a race zigging and zooming all over the place upsetting the whale with their ear splitting roar making him swim too close to the shore oh, there's all the boats you see all the boats this is the tide slipping away oh no and this is the whale lying beached in the bay he is a big whale quick off the sand back to sea cried the snail i can't move on land i'm too big moaned the whale the snail felt helpless and terribly small and i got it she cried and she started to crawl i must not fail said the tiny snail this is the bell on the school in the bay bringing the children in from their play this is the teacher holding her chalk telling the class sit straight don't talk this is the board as black as soot and this is a snail with the itchy foot a snail a snail the teacher turns pale look say the children it's leaving a trail this is the trail of the tiny snail a silvery trail saying save the whale and he uses saline again to do all the writing save the whale these are the children running from school fetching the firemen digging a pool squirting and spraying to keep the whale cool oh wow this is the tide coming back into the bay and these are the villagers shouting Hooray! as the whale and the snail travel safely away oh, they made it back into the sea back to the dock and the flock on the rock who said how tides flew and you haven't grown and the whale and the snail told their wonderful tale of shimmering ice and coral caves and shooting stars and enormous waves and of how the snail so small and frail with her looping curling silvery trail saved the life of the humpback whale then the humpback whale held out his tail an on crawled snail after snail after snail and they've all got on and they sang to the sea as they all set sail on the tail of the grey blue humpback whale and there's all the snails on his tail that's a lovely story that one and she saved the day by using her trail to do all that writing you can have a go at mark mating you might not have slime like a snail has the slime but you can practice with your finger you can do it with a pencil
pencil or you can maybe put some flour in a tray and have a go at seeing if you can do a loopy trail like the snail or maybe try a paintbrush and some water and see if you can do a trail for the snail on your wall have a go and see no, I've got my song box with me today. So shall we see what's inside it? Oh, like we do all the time. I bring that forward, look, and you can see. I'm gonna pat on my lid, but you can join in. You can either bang your knees, or you can clap your hands. Are we ready? What have I got in my box today? My box today, my box today. What have I got in my box? Today, shall we see? Oh, shall we see what's in my box today? Oh, that's right. Can we remember in our story in the sky? We had some stars, we had some bright stars. Do we know a song about a star? That's right, we do. Can we all do twinkle, twinkle? Have you got your twinklies ready? Are we ready? Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are, up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Well done, everybody. There was a star in our story. Now, can we remember what was happening in the weather in our story? Because on Sunday, it was a lovely blue sky, but I think they had a thunderstorm. And I've got something especially in my box for our thunderstorm. Because I brought my foil blanket. You can some lovely sounds. Are we ready? We're going to go, I hear thunder. I hear thunder. I hear thunder. How don't you? How don't you? It's a better rain from. It's a battery raindrop, I'm wet through, so are you. That's a lovely one. And this for lovely to make all the lovely sounds with. Can we do it again? I hear thunder, I hear thunder. How don't you? How don't you already? It's a fatty raindrop. It's a fatty raindrop. I wet through. So are you. Well done, everybody. That was brilliant today. Don't forget, go to www.familycorner.co.uk. More wonderful ideas you could try in the home. Are we ready to sing goodbye now? After three, should we do it together? One, two, three. Goodbye, all the boys. Goodbye, all the girls. Goodbye, everyone. It was nice to see you here. Can we do it one more time? Goodbye, all the boys. Goodbye, all the girls. Goodbye, everyone. It was nice to see you here. Well done, everybody. I'll see you soon.